Hi everybody, Sanbonani. Welcome to my channel. Kamala Mugunda and Mlaja. And on this channel, see I see Buga Ma reality shows. It's all I'm saying. Since it's all so cool, Maga Olama reality shows. Since I'm a reviews or I'm a recap. Since cool, Maga any other issues of Buga Maga Bela Ma shows. Since we are Buga Legwe TV. See I pin the photos. Cool, Maga Ma celebrities. Kanye Nama YouTubers. It's all I'm saying. Africa. If it's your first time joining us today, and you really like our content, do not forget to press the subscribe button. Langes and to pin the press the notification bell. Pella. Let me do this video quickly. Ngo bangu pege upu tunga lena luzosha and abantu baga kwa labazo la ugula ukshile na mslanje umanga benginga sheshits. Anyway, you guys, listen. I want to talk about this thing. Uh, seems right. Hosted e uh, divorce party ka oami. Of OAMI Entertainment, the the divorce part, the big divorce part that we have been waiting for for the whole month. <laughs> but I will tell you why I'm excited about this happening. Okay, so obviously for the past month, there's a lot of videos that we made on YouTube, uh, whole of October, even part of August about uh, OAMI. That a lot of people started saying, "Oguti, there is an OAMI hate train on uh, YouTube." Okay, and I understood it because we were making a lot of videos. Okay, I was like, okay, no, we'll take it. <laughs> if they say we're on a hate train, even though we're not, we'll take it. But one thing that really uh, I wasn't happy about was that there were uh, videos, I think a video or two that was made by uh, YouTubers where they were saying that who seems right. I know one YouTuber specifically said, uh, she feels like who seems right is jumping on uh, the Owami hate train. Mind you, you guys, uh, who seems right hasn't made any video about Owami uh, for the whole drama that has been taking place on YouTube. She hasn't said anything about uh, Owami or Owami entertainment, even with the conflict between uh, uh, Undibutu and Owami that whole thing of copycats or whatever we were making all of the videos but she has never even made a comment on it or made a video about it but there is somebody that made a video and said she feels like oh seems right was jumping on that train i remember watching that video and thinking how did that this person come to this conclusion when uh who seems right really seemed like she was one person that really was neutral in this whole situation and uh in the past you guys there was a time where i thought that there was a, a conflict between usim's rights uh with oami and they had themselves clarified that uh, clarified which they did have a misunderstanding at some point i know that when that patrick uh, uh about patrick shy passed away and there was a video that oami did and usim's rights also did a video there was that misunderstanding i believe which oami had clarified what she did call uh usim's right they had resolved that even usim's right had said with guys i might not be best friends with the owami but i do not have an issue with her so for me it really surprised me Uguti. there were people that were making a conclusion that she had taken sides between uh undibuti no 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 owami mind you usim's right has also said Uguti, because a lot of people are feeling like during this whole thing of copycat issue or copycat gate uh, that Usim's right has started spending more time with Undibuti, uh, which indicates that she's taking Dibuti's side. And But they had indicated because they have been friends since Undibuti. I remember in one video she even said Usi, she has been friends with Undibuti when Undibuti was, uh, had like 400 subscribers. So they have been friends for a long time. It's just that Tina online or on YouTube, we only started noticing Uti. they are actually real uh, friends. Uh, only recently so it did uh, for some people i guess it felt like she was taking sides she was only becoming closer to Ndibuti because of what was going on with the copycat issue here on youtube the thing about uh i guess i i sector <laughs> your content creation sometimes umangabegune drama between the creators 
it's almost like people expect you to take a side okay it's either you on the side or you on that side you can't really be neutral you can't really be like listen, listen i don't care what happens i care about both people or i don't care about uh, both people people wanted to know who just seems ugly beside and sometimes people were deciding which side uh, she was on so when i watched uh, because before i i saw what she had hosted owami's divorce party i actually watched Sims rights uh, vlog this morning when she talked about the fact that Oami had called her in the middle of the night. It felt to me that it wasn't something that uh, she had known that she was going to hold um, to host the event. But Oami asked her last minute the night before that she must host. I feel like number one, the fact that Oami felt comfortable enough to ask Sims the last minute to host her divorce party is a big indication for us that there is no issue there really is no issue because guys you're not gonna go to somebody that you are not uh, cool with to ask them last minute to host your party you know so for me i feel like that is an indication for us to say oami is saying i do not have an issue with sims i am friendly with sims we might not be best friends but we are colleagues and if i need her to help me with something i will ask her and she will say it. she was comfortable enough to say to do that to ask her last minute number two the fact that sims even says in the video that she was doubting whether she she was gonna go to uh, the party or not but after owami called her she felt like she needed to go she also is an indication from sims side to say she cares enough about Oami to say, you know what, even though I had a, uh, I had doubts on whether I should go or not, but since she asked me, it means she really needs me to be there. Let me do this for, for my colleague. It's an indication also from her side that uh, there is no issue. She does not have an issue with Oami. There is nowhere where Usim says, I had to call on the booty and be like, Mgani, are you okay with me going on hosting uh, Oami's uh, party? You know, <laughs> it's nowhere. She was like, Oami called her. She decided she, she does need to go to the party because she had asked him. So it's clear. I'm happy to know that there is no issue between the two people but i'm also very happy to 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 for them to show uh, the space here with youtube because there really is no issue between the two of them so that this thing you who seems right is jumping on the hate train can end seems right doesn't hate anybody in fact who seems right doesn't really make videos about uh oh i'm doesn't uh, doesn't really make videos about i'm a i'm a creators as such unless ends are lazy and just funny i'm a couples are breaking up and all of that but lama videos lama swans are out every time there is drama on youtube other ways lama videos so i do feel like it's always unfair to say you would think when something happens to oh I'm people expect her to say something and if she doesn't say something it means that she hates oh I'm me and then she loves undi, you know so i was very happy to see that but more than that guys the maturity that she is showing in this whole thing i appreciate it because someone else could have said would she because i'm friends with Nibuti, how can i host the party at oh I'm, how is it gonna look uh, she said some things about my friend or whatever the fact that she's able to maintain both friendships no, the different friendships obviously because it seems like she's closer to Ndibuti than she is to Oami, but in terms of working together, being colleagues, she's colleagues with both of that, both of them. So the fact that she's able to maintain both friendships for me indicates a certain level of friendship. Listen, management is managing things here on YouTube, and I love it. I really appreciate it. Uh, seeing that i hope that other people saw it so that they can remove sim's name will enjoy about sims is jumping on the hate train by the way there isn't a train but again <laughs> i also feel like lava but there is a hate train yeah but we train but the lot of it right it's not because we're not there anyway you guys thank you so much for watching this video please like it before you put me on and share it with your friends with your family and even with strangers